How's it going guys, this is Acid Zope here and today I'm bringing you a Cinema 4D tutorial on how to make some nice text. Uh, it's going to be quite a basic tutorial so let's just get straight into it. Uh, I'm going to move down so I'm facing like towards it by using this tool over here, this like circle one on the uh, right. So let's just drag that down, just move it around, you'll get the hang of it after a while. And then move it to, so we're about there. And then I'm going to go to MoGraph and then text object, whack in some text, I'm just going to write my name, hold down here to uh, write your text, let's just write the zone. Okay, and we're gonna go to the line and go middle. And I'm gonna make the depth of 100. And then I'm going, this is, we're gonna change the font and stuff later on, so don't worry about that. Um, click on it, just click on where it says just text object. We're gonna hit Command C and con uh, Command V or Control C, Control V if you're on a PC. And then click on the new one we just duplicated and go to the depth, change it from 100 to 80. And then go to caps, go to fill it cap uh, for start, change the radius down to uh, 2, and then go to end, fill it cap, and take the radius down to 2 as well. And then using this circle tool, which we use to move down, we're just going to move it around. So we're looking, so we're looking like this, so the text is facing the other way. And then we're going to move this, the second one that we just made, into the middle. Uh, and that's, it doesn't have to bang on in the middle, but near enough in the middle will do. And you see, if we just hit render using this one there, it'll give it a nice kind of effect. Now we can change the font, and I'm not sure what font I'm going to use. This was just a very requested tutorial, so I thought I'd just hop on and do it now. Uh, what font should we use? Um, I'm going to use a graffiti font, so let's uh, just go to R and go to raise one. This is a really nice font. As you can see, if we just render that, you can see the font there. Uh, so now it's time to add some colours in, in my opinion. So let's double click down here to bring up a new material. Just double click on this grey bit here. And then we'll double click on that to bring up the material window. And colour, I think we should go for a nice, maybe a kind of greeny yellowy, bright greeny yellowy. This is quite a popular colour now. Take off specular, click glow, and take the outer strength down to around 200 ish. Doesn't really have to be bang on. Um, and then drag that one onto the outside or the, the uh, one you duplicated and then we're going to double click again, make a new one uh, go on matte, go on colour and make it black and then take off specular, so it's just black like that and then we're going to drag that onto the original one, see if we render that out we get kind of like a nice glowing text now another thing we can do is if we just click one layer hold down shift and click another layer and we go to MoGraph, MoGraph sorry, uh, random effector you see it will distort all the um, letters and then we click on the random effector and we can go to parameter here and we can change all of these settings but first we want to tick rotation but we'll get to that in a second so we want to go to X we want to go 0 and Y we want to go 0 and yeah that's basically it if you want to change it you can just play around with these settings make them your own for your own text so we just have a look around you can see it's all not in line and stuff uh, we can go to rotation, just change it. It is really just specific to you, to your text. I normally go up instead of down, but it's your decision. Uh, just just play around with it. Um, you can always just go on the back on the text object. Make sure you hold both. Make sure you have hit shift and hold both down. Otherwise, you don't change one of them. So we're going to go back on both text objects and go to horizontal spacing, and take it into around I don't know twenty ish. It really just depends on your text. So you can see there, it's kind of a little bit nicer. <laughs> 